Hi, this is Rob with a review of the new Facebook camera app. I'm going to show you how to take a photo, edit a photo, and post that photo to, to your Facebook using the new Facebook camera app. This is a free app for use in all Apple iOS devices, the iPhone, iPod Touch, and the iPad. Open the app and you will see your Facebook feed, which is just photos that you and your friends post. Swipe to see more photos. Tap the Me button to see photos that you posted. Tap the Settings icon to log out, view the help pages, or view the privacy and legal documentation. I'm going to tap the Friends and go do a photo. From here you can add a comment by tapping the comment icon or tap the thumbs up to like the photo. Tap on the photo to enlarge it. In the lower left you will see the like, comment, and tag icons. Tap on the photo twice to hide these icons. Tap on the photo again twice to reappear the icons. To zoom in and out of the photo, use your two fingers. You can move the photo around with your finger. To tag a photo, Tap the tag icon and then tap the person's face that you want to tag. The keyboard pops up and begin typing that person's name. To delete a tag, tap on the tag and then tap on the X icon to delete the tag. Tap the photo to go back to the photo's original size. To go back to your feed, tap the photo. You can share photos you've already taken or take a new one to share while using the Facebook camera app. Your location settings need to be turned on to share photos from your Apple iOS devices while using the Facebook camera app. Facebook camera app can't access your photos on your iPhone camera roll until you turn on the location for the app. To take a new photo, tap the camera icon in the top left corner. The photo is added to your camera roll with your other photos. Let's edit and post a photo. Swipe down your Facebook feed to see your camera roll. Tap on a photo you want to edit. You can tap to tag the photo. The keyboard pops up. Tap the crop icon. Move the crop around. Rotate the photo with the rotate icon. Resize the photo and resize the photo and or slightly turn the photo with your fingers. Tap the check icon to save your crop. Tap the filter icon to see a selection of filters very similar to Instagram's filters. Slide through all the filters. Instantly see the effects of the filters by tapping on one of the filters. At this point, you can go back to the camera roll and if your save filter photos is turned on in your iOS device, your editing of that photo will be saved. I'm gonna go back to that photo that I just edited and post it to Facebook. Tap on the photo, tap the post icon on the lower right. The keyboard pops up so you can say something about this photo. If you want to add another photo to this post, tab the plus icon next to this photo. Tap on each photo you want to edit before posting. You can do the same editing option. I'm not going to edit this photo. I'm going to go back to my camera roll. Tap on the check mark for adding additional photos to this post. Tap the post icon. There are three icons below the photos. Tap the icon to the far left to choose who you want to share this photo with. Or if you want to share this photo with one of your list or a group, Tap on the far right icon, swipe through your list, and choose one of your list or audience. I'm going to choose friends. To add a location to a photo, tap this icon in the middle. A list of nearby places will pop up. Choose your location from this list by tapping on it. If you don't see your location, search for it by typing it in the search box. If you still don't see the location you want to share, you can add it. When you're ready to post, tab the post icon on the upper right. Your photo will begin uploading. Your photo is now posted. If you want to delete a photo you posted, tap on the photo to view it. Press on the photo until the delete photo pops up. Tap delete photo. That's it. That's it. What do you think about the new Facebook camera app? If you like this review, please give me a thumbs up and please subscribe to this channel. If you want to see a tutorial on how to make a Facebook timeline cover photo using Photoshop, please click here.